This is water pepper. Tiny little pink flowers, still in flower there, and it's starting to seed and another very heavy seeder. If I'm feeling cruel, I'll get people to chew uh, a leaf of this. You're, you're guessing where this is going already. There's two species, there's water pepper and tasteless water pepper. And the best way to tell them apart is to taste them. And water pepper, of course, no surprises, is, is uh, a, a very peppery. But look at all those seeds that are coming uh, there just now. That's gonna feed our teal through the, uh, through the winter. Another story for, for this one, this is, this is red shank. Uh, with the lovely uh, uh, red flowers flowering at the moment, a little black spot in the leaves uh, there as well. Um, in this situation, this is behaving as an annual, so it's grown from seed, it's flowered and it seeds itself. Once it becomes established, it becomes a perennial, but it stops flowering. It starts spreading vegetatively then, and we don't see these lovely flowers. So it's only in this annual community that we see the lovely flowers of, of red shank. But again, another really heavy seeding species that's gonna provide food for our birds. And another one here, I'm gonna pick this one. This is a, a, a speedwell, pink water speedwell. And you see the little seeds just starting to form there. Another lovely little annual that we only find in, um, in this uh, community. Uh, and, and in fact, in the background there, most of that carpet there is you know, seeding pink water speedwell.